for all things Halloween. <laughs> this is Hauntformer, and everyone, I am back with another R.I.P. review. And today I'm looking at something that I got for Christmas, actually, and this is the Trick or Treat Studios They Live Alien Mask. So if you look at the little card right here, this is a uh, officially licensed They Live mask from Universal Studios and Trick or Treat Studios. This mask is really cool. It is based off the alien creatures from the movie. Now, if you haven't seen the movie They Live, make sure to watch it. Here's the little uh, Blu-ray that I also got for Christmas right there. Uh, it is a movie basically about aliens that take over the media and the government, and you can only see them with these special sunglasses uh, until the end, which I won't completely spoil for you guys. Uh, but it is a pretty cool movie. It's made by John Carpenter, the guy who made the remake of The Thing, and, of course, Halloween with Michael Myers. And this mask is really creepy. Uh, it looks right out of the movie, basically, almost like uh, someone's wearing the makeup for it. Uh, the hair is pretty nice, you know, with the light, you can kind of catch that it looks a little bit fake, uh, but it's not entirely something you'll, you'll notice while wearing this, maybe in a haunted house or on Halloween. Another thing to notice is the detail. This mask has some great detail and some great colors. The mouth has awesome detail with the teeth. The eyes are especially the coolest thing on this mask. They look so creepy, and that comes from the movie and into this mask. And just overall, all around, this mask is really well detailed, and I really do love the paint job and everything on this mask. Whoa, it's trying to fall down on me. Now, if there's one issue I have with this mask, it is the wearing it part. This mask by itself, maybe on, with a display, would be awesome, but if you're going to be someone wearing this mask for, say, Halloween or maybe a haunted house or something, you're gonna run into some issues. The eye slits in this mask are really hard to see out of, basically impossible to see out of, and therefore uh, it makes it a little bit hard to see out of this mask. Now, Trick or Treat Studios, maybe there's a way you can tell me at least how to make the eye slits bigger, but I had difficulty wearing this mask and trying to see out of it and it's also hard to breathe so I need to cut a slit in the mouth here because it's really hard to breathe um so I think aesthetically the, and visually this mask is amazing but when it comes down to putting it on and trying to wear it it runs into some difficulties and I think that also relies on you don't want to mess up any of the detail like with the eyes so how do you see through those beautiful eyes and I understand why there's a problem with that but at the same time, it is a problem. Uh, but overall, I really do enjoy this mask. It's very neat, and if the visual and breathing features of, ma of this mask can be fixed, I'd probably give this a 4.5 out of 5, but because of those, I'm going to have to give them a 4 out of 5 skulls. If you enjoyed this review, make sure to subscribe and follow me on social media, and make sure to check out the rest of the Trick or Treat Studios masks. Remember, as always, for all things Halloween, this is Hauntformer.